Okay, so after you've done the Hopi ear candles, I always finish with a lymphatic massage of the face and this area, which are the opening places for lymphatics. This helps drain and clear. And this really supports any kind of upper respiratory issues, such as blocked sinuses. And again, you'd need to speak to a healthcare professional about how often you would need to have this done and for how long. Lymphatic massage uses very specific movements to clear, release and get the, fluid, the lymphatic fluid moving through the system to help detoxify. You repeat movements quite often, but as I'm just demonstrating this now, we'll just do a few. And the reason why you do this post hopi or ear candling is just to support the detoxification process and also it helps with the equilibrium of the ears again. I usually do about a 20 minute treatment post hopi but again it does vary because it depends on each person. So I hope this video has helped you see how, how ear candling and massage can support upper respiratory health, um, health issues. Thank you.